Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 34, and this is war number six. And we're going up against an alliance called Gods of MCOC. So let's check and see what we have in store. I keep doing that because I'm used to it. I need to go into this one so I can see who they've banned. Okay, who did you ban? Ooh, they did not ban Spider-Man 2099. All right, they did ban Human Torch, Magneto, and Corvus. Okay. Let's hit the uh, preview here. Let's see what we got. All right, so I don't have anybody on that first node, and then we've got... Ooh, okay, so we have um, Hit Monkey, and then we have Man-Thing, who is very annoying. That's why they didn't put Human Torch... Uh, why they banned Human Torch. Um, he's really annoying on that uh, node. Warlock, not a good option. Um, maybe Black Widow uh, could do it, but yeah, that's going to be a pain. I'm hoping somebody else uh, is going to bring somebody in. Um, if I bring Warlock, maybe uh, Domino, I could take her. All right, we've got Nick Fury. Blah. Um... Could do Spider-Man 2099 against him, maybe. Okay, we got Colossus, that's Claire. We've got um, Red Goblin, that's also Claire. Ooh, my nemesis, Nimrod. That'll be Warlock. Who do we got here? Oh, we have Null. I don't know if I've fought Null with uh, Spider-Man 2099. I don't know. We'll see. Um, when we get there, we'll see. Hmm. And I'll take whoever else, uh, depending on who I have, if they ask me to take them. But that's, I'm going to probably go in with uh, Black Widow, Warlock, and Spider Man 2099. And I should be good there. All right. Let's get with the fighting. All right, we're back, and I'm going in with my standard team. This time, they did not ban my Spider-Man 2099. Um, so, first fight is going to be against Hitmonkey. Now, I want you to see something that happened here. So, when I went in here like this, right, everything was looking all right. I'm looking over, you know, the nodes just to remind myself uh, of the nodes. Gonna boost up. Okay, just a little 15% boost. I, I got, as you can see there now, got plenty of them, but look at what happens. Look at this. I've clicked it. You can see it. You can see the spinning uh, uh, white wheel here, right up there. And now I got the symbol. This is not a good start. Now, of course, I've been playing a little bit and everything, and I know some people always restart. I don't usually, but when something like that happens, I'm like, no, let's back on out, <laughs> restart the game, and uh, go in like that, just in case, just in case, you know? Um, however, there have been times where I've done that, and it didn't help. I restarted, went in, and it still crashed on me. So we'll see. We'll see what happens, right? Now, Hit Monkey, you don't want anything going wrong with Hit Monkey. You will die very, very quickly. He's easy to fight, but you need to have it everything right. Now, I don't know if you saw that, but I had to hit it twice in order to actually go in there game is not running well at this point okay so we go ahead we're just fighting hit monkey i don't really want to knock him down it's just annoying okay when you knock him down so bait out special ones and just fight him like normal straight up literally don't knock him down if you do knock him down well you're just gonna have to be very careful and wait that thing out but as you saw it went smooth. When it doesn't go smooth, 
just as fast as that fight was, he'll wreck you even faster. So he's always a little bit, you know, dicey. You, you don't want to, you know, relax too much when you're fighting him. Now, the mini boss was Man-Thing. And I, from experience, know that I do not have anyone that's really good against that Man-Thing. Uh, I can use uh, Black Widow, Clairvoyant, go into Curse of Plague, that'll protect me from the poison, but I still have to deal with the uh, shocks. She would be my best option though. But as you saw, uh, they went ahead in there. Now, if you'll notice, we only had one attack bonus left on it, which means they died twice. I kind of felt bad because I could have died twice too to take it out. The reason I didn't go in is because I was hoping one of them had a better option than I did. But Black Widow Clairvoyant could take him in two tries, no problem. And I might get lucky and actually uh, fight him and beat him in one. So anyway, this fight, standard fight against uh, Colossus. You guys have seen it many times because that's a favorite for that node. And normally Colossus is great for that node. It's just that Claire is like his natural enemy. Claire just rips him apart. Look at that, he has no armor ups now and he won't get any armor ups uh, that's gonna last, <clears throat> not against Claire. So as you can see here, you know, I try to tap him a little bit on his block so he can remember that I'm over here and he's actually fighting so he don't turtle up and the fight's over, that's it. All right, next up is a fight that I, I can't remember if I've ever fought him there. Uh, it's not someone I usually fight in war, but uh, Red Goblin. So I was like, well, I've fought Red Goblin before, so it shouldn't be too difficult. I'm trying to figure out why they put him here. So I'm looking there, I'm like, okay, he's not benefiting from the defense tactic. So this should be basically a regular fight against him. Just don't, you know, I really don't have to worry about anything. Even if I hit into his block, I can nullify the armor up. So I won't have to worry about that. So it looks like it's just a straight up regular fight against Red Goblin. And I fought him just not very often in war. All right, so just wanna bait out that special one. Although the special two, I don't really evade the special two completely. I do it sort of like um, I usually do uh, Apocalypse. You know, I'll get hit the first bit and then uh, dodge out of the second or last part so not a difficult fight all right now by the time i got in here they had already taken out uh that mini there so i didn't get a chance to fight any minis on my left hand side so i'm looking at this and i'm like okay i'm gonna sit here and i'm waiting for orders okay just waiting for them to tell me who they want me to fight. But guess what? There was nobody. They didn't uh, have me fight anyone and they went ahead and cleared the rest of the uh, war. So it was a fairly easy war for me. I'm gonna check and make sure, but no, I don't think I, I fought any more. All right, so we'll be back in a minute and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back, and as you can see, we won. Second win in a row. So we're doing pretty well. Boy, do I have a lot to tell you guys about how my day went. Now, some of you already know about the technical difficulties I was having. I'll talk more about it later on today, provided we're able to stream. Uh, I had network issues, which seemed to also cause some computer issues. Uh, I went through, I rebooted my machine twice. I updated my graphics driver because I was having some other issues just in editing and in uh, Streamlabs and things like that. And everything looks like it's okay. So we should be able to stream just fine later on today, normal time, uh, but we'll see. Anyway, that's gonna do it guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Now. 
one last comment. Some of you guys probably noticed that I'm using my live stream layout. That's because it's late and I'm not about to redo all of that just because I had the layout for the live stream. So it's just going to be up there. But that's why you hear the music that you normally hear doing the live stream and all of that. That's why. All right. But anyway, take care and you all have a blessed day. Thank you